Hello and welcome back to another episode of Checkpoint. Today we are playing Phantom Halls, which is a spooky, spooky game. Um, so if you guys want to see more of this game once we get into it, please let me know. I'm just going to check all the options are good. Quality lure? Let's put that up there. Let's do, let's do something like that. All this stuff, don't know what it means. It'll be fine, I'm sure. We should probably check the controls, actually. They're right there. Controls. Here we go. Hopefully this doesn't crash the game. Uh, that seems good, right? Uh, so it looks like we're not actually using... Yeah. Yeah, this looks fine. Are we actually going to be using the, the mouse? I don't know. Let's just, let's just go with it. It'll probably tell us. Phantom Horse. Man, I'm excited. Alright, so we have all these characters we can play as. We've got the goth, the jock, the cheerleader, the nerd, or Ash from the Evil Dead. Man. Who should I go for? Who would be good? I guess... I should go with someone like, maybe the jock or the nerd? I mean, I don't know. I, I don't think the goth or the cheerleader would be very appropriate since they're both ladies and I am not a lady. Um, let's go with the nerd. Why not? I'm not sure if like each... Uh, pest control. These are the available quests for each one. Okay, so they might all have like one quest each. Let's have a look. Yes, they do. Okay. That's what it seems like anywhere. Right, so let's do the nerd one first. I'm not sure if each house has like a different, uh, not each house, each character. Sorry, I was reading the the description down there. I saw the word house and I got confused. I don't know if each character has like a different like advantage to other ones, but we'll find out. Pest control. So we've got to eliminate some bugs or something. Okay, we're in. Keep the nerd alive. Kill 24 bugs. So as you can see, this has got a really nice art style. Oh, here we go. All right, how do we do this? So is it Q? To, what does Q do? Okay, is that my attack button or? Right, it looks like I can't use the mouse, so I don't know why it's giving me like a a cursor. We could probably move that off the screen, right? Right, keep the nerd alive. It's going good so far. Let's kill all these bugs. Oh wait, does that make me face in a certain direction? What an odd little control. Okay, let's keep pressing S. And um, we've got to find these bugs. I can hear them. We can definitely hear them. So yeah, this art style is really cool. It's kind of like a paper craft thing. Oh, what's this clock do? Can interact with it. That's for sure. Hmm. Hickory. This has potential as an impromptu weapon. Okay, so how do I access? There we go. That's my inventory. So as you can see in the top left here, I have a flashlight. I've also got a bat because nerds would have a baseball bat. Uh, I, maybe they should have like a giant pencil or something or a big calculator. <laughs> and, um... What's this over here? Oh, it's the drop item. Okay. Um, so where's the thing I just picked up? I'm not sure. Let's just get back into it. Now let's go through this door. Still haven't seen a bug. I wonder what they're going to look like. Maybe they're going to look like really creepy. Should we go up the ladder or whatever this is? Why not? So it looks like we attack with Q. Do I just like... Can I press it instead of... No. Because it's a bit awkward. Because the way you turn around is with the mouse. But the way you attack is with Q. Obviously it's uh, A and D to move around. S to open doors. Um, and it's also S to interact. We can interact with this thing. Uh, this game isn't multiplayer. You'd think it'd be multiplayer with, like, the multitude of characters, but it doesn't seem to be. We've got some sort of bullets there or something. Hmm. I'll investigate. What are we gonna find? Was that a flare gun? A flare gun? Look at that. And there's some pistol ammo. Unfortunately, we don't have a pistol. I still haven't seen these bugs. Oh! Did you see that on the other side of that door? Hold on. Better make sure we're all equipped up for this. All right, let's make a move. Let's do it. Oh, what did I just pick up? A hammer? Oh, sweet. Well, let's try out the bat first of all. I think there might be some on this. Oh, no. We're still all good. Oh, there's one. Look. Let's go for it. Let's do it. Kill them. Oh, I take no pleasure in your death, insect friend. We're just slashing away. Okay, we got rid of that one. Uh, let's press S again. So we killed two bugs. Both of those things were bugs. We got a crowbar. And where's my health? Do I, like, get to see where my health is, or...? I'm not sure. Uh, inventory full. Oh, I've got some flares as well. We'll have to drop something, because we've got a flare gun. Um, we probably don't need the crowbar. Oh, we could drop the... Let's drop the bat, because it's, like, the... The weakest item. Um, okay. Let's pick up the flares. There we go. Fortunately, we can't move faster than this... Oh, I hear them on the other side of this door. There we go. Oh, God, what are they? They're like beetles and cockroaches? Did I get it? Ugh, ugh. Okay, what am I using now? Like a hammer. Um, oh, look out! Dude! Oh, jeez. 
No. What is that? A sword? A machete? Dude, I want that. Oh my god, a chandelier just dropped on us. I can't quite kill this. There we go. There we go. It's just <laughs> it's just been flung off into the distance. Alright, so our inventory's full again. Um what damage does that machete have? Two to five. Um Man, I don't know what we could drop. Probably shouldn't drop the flashlight. We might have to come back for this. Hopefully it stays there. Um Oh wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Do you my hammer and Okay, let's drop the hammer. Let's let's drop that. Just because they do just about the same damage, but a machete deals like two to five. Yeah, this is fine. I think I'm wielding some sort of axe right now. Uh, we've still got a bunch more bugs to kill, to take out, so we better do that. Got a flare. Let's open this. It's locked. According to my calculations, that door is impenetrable. Yeah, my calculations. All you have to do is, like, wiggle the doorknob, and if it doesn't open, that means it's unopenable. You don't have to do some calculations or some complex algorithmic equations. Nah, all you gotta do is push on the door a little bit, nerd. Why are you a nerd with these sort of, like... Lack of knowledge. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm literally just saying words. Okay, I'm a bit lost right now, but we should be fine. Uh, as I said, we can't go much faster than this. Uh, is this my health? Oh, no, that's just what I'm equipping right now. I don't think I can check my... Oh, look, here's a buff. Pocket protector. Weapon durability is less... Uh, weapon durability is loss? Right, well, it's reduced by 75%. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. <laughs> did, did you see his head, like, snap back? It's not good. All right, let's have a look. Oh, God. More bugs. There wasn't one. Oh, I pressed the tab button by accident. Ah! Oh, I'm dead. But how could I see, like, my... I couldn't see my, um, thingy-majigamy, my health. That's interesting. All right, let's try it with someone else this time. Should we go with a jock? Uh, dress to kill. I hate the prom, but if I have to wear a dress, I'm going to make it myself. All right, are we in the same house? Okay, cool. Okay, I'll need about a dozen pairs of bats. Wait, why would you need that much for a... For a, um, a dress? Let's go to the right this time. Again, I think it's Q to fire. So we'll find out. I think they really should just put the... Um... Put the, uh, weapon usage on the, on the mouse. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> that headbang she can do. She's probably listening to a heavy metal goth music. Da -da 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 -da. All right, let's move. Let's keep moving. Let's do it. Oh! Wow. Uh, what is that, a zombie? Can we hold down? All right, there goes the bat. Shoot the skeleton in the head. All right, there we go, bat wing. We got one. Thanks, bat. You died violently for a very good cause, okay? Okay. Let's take this. Time to split some heads. All right, let's move further this way, because I just want to experiment with something. I think I'm probably mistaken. I'll know when I get through this door, though. Um, the developers refer to this game as, like, Spelunky, and I know Spelunky is procedurally generated, so... Oh, no, maybe it's not procedurally generated. Oh, no, we're empty. Oh, crap, let's shut this door. Shut the door, shut the door! Goth! No, no. Right, let's use the shotgun. How do we equip? Do I go like this? Okay, and we can drop this. Here we go, we got the shotgun out. Oh, no, did I just pick that back up? I don't know. Fire! I missed. <laughs> oh, God. Is that it? That's all I got? Right, we're gonna have to use the machine pistol. Here we go. Nice. There we go. The birth dead. Jeez. Okay. We're picking these up. Yeah. There we go. All right. So we've got 18 rounds left. Probably have to find a weapon pretty soon. What is that in there? There's someone stood there in like a suit of armor. Oh, we got some ammo. Sweet. I hope he doesn't come alive. Oh God. A metalhead. Ah, uh, is he my friend? Oh, sweet. So on Q and W, okay, so we've got two people now. Right. Let's fire away. Oh god, Metalhead, do your business. Go! Wow, <laughs> he just thwacked him. Alright, let's kill this skeleton. Oh jeez, we need to keep our distance, there we go. Shot him in the head. Right, can we pick up anything from him? Again, I can't see my health, I wonder if it's this thing. But that says to me that's like the ammo we've got remaining, I don't know. Can we pick up anything that will help with that anywhere? I mean, we're doing pretty terrible right now. Here's Johnny. Oh, he's got an axe or something. Cool. That's good. Good for you, friend. If you could find me some health, that'd be much appreciated as well. Right. Okay, we've got a machete. Sweet. 
Right, let's get ready to fire just in case that chandelier is going to drop down. Let's. Can I shoot it and make it drop down before? No, you can tell it's going to drop down. Look, ready? Ah, never mind then. <laughs> the one time I walk under a chandelier and it doesn't drop down. Okay, anything here? Metalhead's having a look around. He's found another axe. He's got to build up a sizable axe collection. So that's good. All right, we're all good. The squad is moving in. Is this chandelier going to drop? Nope. Once again, none of the chandeliers are dropping. So I guess we're going all the way to the left, the right this time, rather. Not the left, the right. Um, so let's go that way. We can't leave the house as well. It's quite spooky. Look at this. Hello? All right. The music's gone very quiet. Ah, we can interact with this thing. All right, you have a look in there, buddy. I'm going to move in. He found some... What was that? What did he just find? Oh, look, we've got double the inventory. Shotgun shells. Okay. So uh, do we just... How do we reload? Can I? Like... Ah, there we go. We got the ammo back now. That's interesting. Still, again, look, we can't... Do we have anything to heal us up? It doesn't look like it. Right, should we go up? Let's just have a look in here. Maybe there'll be, like, something that'll heal us up. Like a big... I don't know. Health kit. Something like that. What is that? Some ammo. Okay, brilliant. Let's go up. Let's do it. Um, hello? I can hear the bats. Not getting through that. Okay. Oh, no. Didn't mean, didn't mean to do that. Yeah, these controls are very odd. Uh, anything in here? There's like a mirror. Let's have a look in there. While you do that, I'll have a look in here. You got some ammo. I got some machine pistol ammo. Hello? This chandelier's gonna drop. This is gonna be the one. Oh no! A bat! Hold on. Oh, and a skeleton. Reload! Dude! There we go. We killed it. Now we need to swap to our machine pistol. If we can. Oh wait. Am I dead? Have I got to remove the shotgun first? Why does it mean... Why does it... Got me crossed out. Does that mean we're not we can't go any further? I guess so. Uh, let's use the There we go. Come on, metalhead. We can do it. Nice. Alright, we got a bunch of uh bat wings there, so that's good. So can we not use the Huh, I don't know. We, for some reason we can't swap to the Oh no, the back. Maybe they regenerate their health over time. Let's have a look at that meter for a second. I don't think they do. Right, we're in a whole lot of trouble here. If this chandelier falls, we're screwed. Oh, man, I knew it. I knew <laughs> I called it. Did I not just call it? I did totally call it. All right, I think we're going to leave it there. I think we're going to turn this into a checkpoint and chill episode. So just one little look at this game. If you guys would obviously like to see me play more of it, though, we can change it from a checkpoint and chill into an actual series. Just let me know. Leave a comment down below, leave me a subscribe, leave a like, all that good stuff, and I will see you in the next episode of Checkpoint. This has been Steve, that has been Phantom Halls. You can get right now on Early Access Checkpoint Complete.